Hey guys, Samro here, and welcome back to The Legend of Zelda Skyward Sword. In the last episode, we finally finished up all of the remaining side quest related stuff by getting the last gossip stones, the last six gossip stones, or seven I should say if you count the, uh, the Moonlight Merchant. But yeah, we finally got all those out of the way. That was the one thing stopping us from being able to just go ahead and beat the rest of the game and do the last dungeon. And also, one other thing that I did off-screen but recorded the footage, so I'm gonna show you now. Next to the place where there's that money-making game, the Thrill Dig minigame, in the Elden region, there was one cracked wall I never blew up that has 40 rupees behind it. And, uh, you know, pretty minor thing, uh, not really anything that's useful to us at this point, and not something that's at all required to beat the game, or a notable side quest thing. I just thought I'd go ahead and show you guys just because I remembered it, and I just went ahead and did it, but I didn't think it was worth, like, doing it in a recording session. I just went ahead and recorded it just so I could show you guys. But anyway, we're done with that shit now. There's nothing left. There's nothing left now. Nothing left stopping us. We're gonna go. We're gonna go into the Sky Keep. We're gonna beat it, and we're gonna beat the game. Woo! That's how this series is gonna end. Uh, come on. There we go. Yep, in we go. Down, down below, down below. Awesome, we're gonna win. We're gonna do this. Finally. Okay. Now, uh, when we first entered this place, we arranged the maps- Oh, okay, good, they got rid of it. Because I put, like, this one here, and then I put the, uh, Furore's uh, the Triforce of Courage one here, but that would prob- that probably wasn't the best decision because, um, you know, it's blocked off and you can't really go anywhere if you were to p put the Triforce of Courage here. So what we have to do is we have to do this, and we have to, um, do something like that. Uh, hmm. Maybe something along those lines. Trying to... Hmm. I'm trying to get this thing out of the way. Okay, I think that doesn't solve the problem, okay. Uh, shoot. Oh, wait, I think I might have an idea. Hold on a second. Okay. Yup. No, not that, um, oh wait, mm, no, okay, no, one more round of this, okay, no, okay, two more rounds of this. Hmm. No. Uh. Crap. Yeah, this might take a bit of organizing. Okay. How am I gonna do this? I ain't gonna do it like that. Oh, oh, I think I might have an idea. I might have an idea, sar soldier. Oh, wait. Oh, what if I try it like this? Maybe. This is so frustrating! Oh, wait. Oh, I found it. I found out how to do it. There we go. Okay. So this'll... Maybe this'll... I don't know what's in that room, like, in between, but maybe that'll... In some way be helpful. Hopefully... there. There's more than one of those, like, room organizer things, so, um... 
we, uh... Okay, go, okay. For a second I was like, wait, am I recording? Okay, yeah, but anyway. Um... So yeah, uh, you'll find that many rooms in this dungeon are actually inspired by previous dungeons we've come across in the past. Uh, like this one, for instance, instance is similar to the Skyview Temple or the Farron Woods in general. Like, yeah, different dungeons and different regions. Um, you are dead. Oh, wow, with the Master Sword we can kill the golden, golden Deku Babas in one hit. That's awesome. Alright, um... Just gonna get the tough beetle and just, and uh, cut that rope. But yeah, so if all goes to plan, this should be either the last recording session or the second to last, as I mentioned in the last episode. All right. So we'll see what happens. But hopefully everything goes well. Dare. Alrighty, hello. Just gonna spin you around and, uh, no. Yes? Oh, crap. Stab him in the belly! Stab him in the belly! All it takes is one stab with a true Master Sword. Absolutely blazing through the enemies we had trouble with before. I see you up there, Phoenix. I see you up there. I see you, and I know there's bombs here. So I'm gonna, uh, where are you? Oh, there's that, th those things there as well. Phoenix! Die! Oh, that was a fail. Okay, come on. Gotta complete the series. We must do this! It's it's gonna take over a hundred episodes. Probably already is over a hundred episodes at this point. This is where it ends. We're gonna do it. I, I, I gotta savor the moment a bit more. I shouldn't f seem like, oh, I'm rushing to the end. But, you know, I do want to get this done. I can't hide that, but at the same time, you know, savor the moment. But yeah, anyway. Relive some of the past memories where... Oh, this is actually kind of a mix of um the... um. Well, I guess it's not so much inspired by the Farron Woods and Skyview Temple, more the ancient cistern, actually, now that I think about it. Claw shot. Oh, yeah, we can stand in the fish's mouth. That's cool. I'm just gonna jump across here. Oh, ho, ho, ho! Um. Yeah, good thing we took out those things, otherwise they'd fire breathe on us. Dare! All right. Blue! Close one. Okay, yeah, there's some butterflies over there, so that means there's one last goddess wall. Actually, I don't know if that's the last goddess wall, but... Yeah, anyway. Let's see if we can actually draw a good rupee this time. Because we all know how well I've done that in the past, but, yeah. Man, the glow is even brighter on the true Master Sword. Kind of gets in the way of some of the drawing. Yep. Didn't think so. Ah, well, it's not like we need rupees anyway. We're at, we're at 2.5 thousand, and we can hold up to 9,900, so... I think we're good. I think we're good, and now I'm just gonna... There we go. Okay, let's see what awaits us in this room. Oh, based off the Lanayru mining facility. Uh, oh no, specifically that um, that one like pirate um, pirate stronghold area in, when we were in the Sand Sea. Nice. It wasn't even that long ago at the time I'm recording this. Oh no. Sorry, sorry, I'm not gonna bother with you Technoblins, just gonna let you die in the pa in the future, I should say. Oh, I will have to deal with this guy, however. Okay. Bring on, bring on your little grenade phonies. Or cronies, I should say. Not phonies. Phonies mean something different. Alright, come at me one last time. We got the Hillian shield now. Oh my! 
makes more sense that the that the Hillian shield would bat those things back than the um the wooden shield. But yeah, so I'm just gonna put that there. I hmm, thought there were like electric electricity bars on the other side there. I was like, what? Alrighty. Hmm. Okay, oh. Just gonna place it right here. Oh, are you serious? Mm. Oh, I see, I have to throw it through, that makes sense. Mmm, nice. Clever, I like that. Alright. Did I? I did. Good. Okay, so that's just how we get this thing up here. Okay, that makes sense. Because we can't bring it up the ladder with us. As much as that would make sense, I mean, you know, I'm... Ah, oh, yep, see, another, another design, another room shifter tablet. Yeah, I mean, I, th I would think Link could carry this with him. Um could carry that with him alongside, um, j j like, w just climb with one arm, carry that ball in the other, but, hey, I didn't make this game. Don't know how to make a game, or at least not one this complicated, or like, you know, well made. I did take one, like, game design class one time, and I made two, like, um, like, pretty basic games. One that was just a maze level. The other, that was one where, like, you're in a park and you're being attacked by enemies and you have to... And pe you eat pizza to get health. And, uh... And, um... You have to, like, collect all the gold coins, uh, before dying. Who knows, I might stream that one time. Yeah, just, yeah, random game I made in Unity for a game design class. Nothing too special. Don't see myself uh, making a career out of being a game designer. Not really for me, I don't think. Guessing that's a shortcut. Yup. Okay, so that. Oh, hi. Oh. Well, that was interesting. Okay, so what What did these do? Uh... <laughs> oh, I see. I have to shoot them all. Alright, well first I may as well kill this bastard. Okay, uh... Uh, no, 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 no! <laughs> Nice try, nice try. Oh, okay. Pfft. Okay, so I missed my chance to shoot that thing up there. First, I may as well take out this thing. Yeah, if I tried to make a career out of making games on Unity, I would, um... be about as successful as the infamous Fred Fox from the Angry Video Game Nerd. Alrighty. Shoot that. Shoot. Oh, I've already shot that. Oh god. Gotta center in a bit more. Okay, I shot that one already as well. I shot both of those. There we go. Perfecto. Okay, so that unlocks this way as well. Nice. Okay, cool. All right, may as well take this with me. Because I'm probably going to need it to get out of here. Okay, so... So this leads to the Triforce of Courage, but I can't really get to that place, like, 
in order to get the Triforce of Courage, I would have to get to a certain place that I know I can't get to uh, without going through this door, so that's a problem. So that's why we need to change things up here. So... Hmm... Okay. Yep. Okay, now I can move this room. I can't move that room, alrighty. Uh, hmm. Oh! Hold on a second. Oh, I could backtrack. That's an idea. Interesting. What's in that room, I wonder? Hmm. Well. Okay, how about the- Okay, so I assume that's the starting room. So I guess here I can just backtrack and see what's there. Okay, there's one. Well.